Example, 2.34 times 2. Now we already know how to multiply multi-digit numbers. So the only new challenge here is knowing where the decimal ends up in the final answer. Let's line it up like this, and we'll do exactly as we did before. We'll multiply the 2 on the bottom by each of the digits in the upper number. 2 times 4 is 8. 2 times 3 is 6, so we can put the 6 here. 2 times 2 is 4, so we put the 4 down here. Now, the question, where does the decimal go? And here's the trick. Count the total number of decimals involved in the numbers that we're multiplying. There are two decimals in the first number, and there are no decimals in the second number. So we need to have two decimals in our answer. So here's where the decimal would go. One, two, and the decimal is right here. And our final answer is 4.68.